During the scouting, I mentioned that you can use a custom code Q for free balls or for sets to highlight the ball that was played by a coach. So let's get the let's get now the hitting uh, percentage for just this ball that was played by a coach. So let's put it after free ball. So again, what we want to do is we will just copy that, right? And now what we want to do is. Uh, we will need to add, uh, yeah, we will need to add another formula here, which would be vs end. So let's add it here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to actually copy that, and I'm going to write this formula in uh, Excel Formula Beautifier to make it a bit easier. So we have the vs end, yeah, we have vs or. So the vs count of total number is going to take us under consideration or the spike of home team or away team because we have to do that and now we have to understand where to put the next code so this would be here before the last bracket so let's put a comma here and now we want to put that the free ball that in a custom code had a Q is going to be one play before so how to select the custom code Q. So you do that by using double comma. So if you use first comma, the first comma is going to move you to the extended code. So extended code for spiking would be H for hard spike, T for tip, and uh, numbers from 0 to 4 to uh, specify the number of blockers. For reception, the extended code would be R for right side pass, uh, W for short pass, uh, these are the extended codes that you can use in Volley Station. And if you use second comma, you are moving to the custom code. So uh, this would mean that we actually look for or numbers uh, or hits of uh, home team or, or away team. And we look for a free ball that was one play before. And how to pay, put that? You use a semicolon to put filters and we will use P minus one. So play minus one is this free ball. Yeah, and this is uh, how we need to put that. Obviously we had to take a look that we are missing one bracket here. So we just add it, we copy that and let's paste it into our uh, cell. And we have a number of two which is good because we can always check that, go back to the scout and we can see that we have two free balls that are with Q, so there should be two spikes after that. And now let's put the kill percentage and efficiency, so I will just copy that. So now again, what you want to do is you want to change VS count for VS per, uh, VS per, and you want to add kill symbols here after A, yeah, so the kill percentage was zero percent and now let's copy this one again and now we want to get efficiency of this ball so we just put f and we need, don't need to put any symbol for efficiency so effic efficiency is minus 50 percent and it sounds right because one of our spikes got blocked and the other one was not finished so, uh, that's it again what you can do is you copy and paste to get the numbers of these players as well.